After more than 5 million views on our video about the hop, we got hundreds of emails. And the biggest question was, how do we teach the hop? So today, let's learn the hop. The first thing that we discuss when talking about the hop is the timing of the hop. We want to be at the top of our jump at the point the hitter makes contact with the ball. As you'll notice with our players, some of them hop two to three inches, some of them hop six to eight inches. Either one is fine as long as you're at the top of your jump when the ball is hit. There's two ways to get ready to hop. There's the creep method, which most of our middle infielders do, and then there's the side-to-side -side hop method, which our corners do. The creep method means that I'm going to creep forward as the pitcher's going through a windup, and as that ball enters the hitting zone, I'm gonna take my hop from that position. The corner infielders set their feet and kind of sway side to side and hop from that position as the ball is entering the hitting zone. What we're looking for out of a good hop is if the ball is not hit, that we're landing softly, low to the ground, and not leaning in any direction. The purpose of the hop is to eliminate any false steps. We teach our kids not to anticipate once the ball is thrown. Any anticipation of where the ball is going to go happens before the pitcher starts. There's a few ways that we teach this drill, including standing on a box and hopping down, hopping over a hurdle, or just hopping one, two, three, hop, and having the coach point to one side or the other for them to get used to what it's like to hit the ground ready to go. One of the drills we use most often to make sure that our first step coming out of the hop is what we want is the hula hoop drill. What you're looking for in the hula hoop drill is that when the player crosses over, they're taking large first step and second step to gain the most ground possible. The two things that I teach all the infielders to be prepared for as soon as they finish the hop is the ball hit hard right at them and to move side to side. We don't worry about going back or forward until after the first step. One of the things here at Auburn that is important to us is to put our kids in the best position to have success. That means borrowing things from other sports. The hop is something I learned playing professional baseball, and it made its way to professional baseball through other sports like tennis and soccer. Being athletic isn't independent to certain sports. That's why we feel the hop has been successful for us. If you have any other questions about the hop or anything else we do, comment on our Facebook page or tweet us at Auburn underscore softball.